You spend your whole life working in the theater business, and now you have a Tony in your hand. What's going through your mind? I never, ever, for one second, ever thought that would ever happen. I didn't, I never thought I would be in the commercial theater. I never thought I would move to New York. I certainly didn't think I would ever direct a musical on Broadway. So it is, um, uh, it is, uh, it's been very, thinking about it and dealing with the Tonys coming up has been very practical. It has to do with business and it has to do with campaigning and all that sort of stuff and the press office and trying to be responsible to our, to our producers and to our investors. And now it just sort of feels a little giddy and fun. <laughs> Yeah. You know, yeah. What they call your name. Yeah. You have 90 seconds to do the whole entire thing. Was there someone you forgot to thank tonight that you, they could watch at Broadway World tomorrow? Somebody you wanted to thank? A mentor or a friend or somebody? I wanted to. I, I, uh, it's two people who have passed away, three people who have passed away, uh, that, uh, that I think it's, uh, it's maybe um, possibly kind of. You know, they, they, they've hopefully are, are part of a consciousness that does not require uh, hovering around me and hearing me call their name. But I was, I had a, a great friend uh, in my father, Richard Cromer. I had a great friend in my uh, 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 theater teacher, Sheldon Patinkin. And I had a great friend in my younger brother, Michael, who are, are all gone now. They're looking down on you tonight, believe me, my friend. Oh, thanks, thanks. You know, I was going to say, this is such a rare, we had many conversations about yeah. this show. Once in a blue moon, you get to work on something that is almost undescribable of what it is when you create something with a team. This is this show for you, isn't it? I think it is. Probably also because I'm terrible at explaining it to people. <laughs> <laughs> like terrible, I was like, well, it's a thing, you know, like I think it's hopefully it's a, it has a, it's a sequence of uh, sensations and events that kind of cumulatively work on someone. And someone said to me the other day, I really liked it, I don't know why, so, which is does not really a selling point, but uh, you know. But you know, it's a show that you think is not about a lot, but it's about everything. That's the idea, that's the idea. I, I, I have, have had the pleasure of having uh, mentors use the term. Um, the universal is in the particular, and so the smaller. Uh, it's about the. It's like DNA. It's like the 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 whole world is in a small event. If you explore it and understand how it's how it's made, and that can be sort of cloned up into the whole dinosaur. I started the spinning about 25 years ago, but yeah. when you spin for me, I'm going to ask you what comes to mind. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. Okay. When you spin from there. It spins really fast. Uh, hold on. Hold on. Let me yeah. think. What, oh, what comes to mind when? when yeah, when you spin. Yeah. Uh, the, the spinning the Tony mirror bit in the producers. <laughs> Where will your Tony live? Do you have any idea yet? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I would like it to be someplace uh, non-ostentatious, uh, uh, yet respectful. <laughs> All of your fans at Broadway World sort of tweet in to figure out where that place is. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Somebody, somebody tell me. Okay. Oh, what? They, somebody did say it? No, they oh, will. They will. Okay, I'd like to know. I don't know. Where should I put it? 